you need a piece of metal that is four and a half inch long. So if you get that kind of uh, thing, you will cut here and here, and then just bend here and here, so that in the end you obtain something like this. Okay, so that's why I cut, bend, cut. Uh, you will have to slightly enlarge the hole here and here. But otherwise, uh, those things work pretty well out of the box. So here is a, like a scraper that's going to be on the left hand side and scraping to the right. So I put more material so I can trim it in place. Uh, basically, I just do all four holes and uh, put those uh, self tapered screws there. This is going to be below the caliper, so it doesn't really matter if it sticks out. But here you will have to cut what's sticking out of the bolts here so that it doesn't hit the caliper. Caliper is going to be coming here, flush like this. So for the install, step one, I will the bolt from the caliper. So if you look at the stock bolt, it doesn't go all the way through the caliper. Usually it's, uh, it sits like a quarter inch of the hole here. So you remove these bolts and you find a bolt that is slightly longer so that it can go on the other side. So this one will go completely through and I'm going to put a nut on the other side. Finished one. So here I have the bolt going all the way through with the bracket here and the nut securing on the opposite side of the bolt and secure to uh, the uh, bracket, I have a piece of uh, UHMW ultra high molecular weight uh, PE, so super hard plastic, like the same one we use for the underbody protection here. And now this piece here is going to scrape the wheel just directly before the caliper. So to make sure the bracket fits in, I did a small cut here on the shield with the cutting wheel. I'm uh, starting to test fit, so the uh, Method's wheels are slightly uh, at an angle, so you look at where it's hitting and you can start to uh, cut down slightly until uh, you can fit the, uh, the wheel in.